Brad. Bradley. Brad. Please report to the stage, young man. It's yeah. Brad's birthday, man. Well, right. right. Just in case you guys didn't know. You guys, in case you guys didn't have, have a clue. All right, well, she's gonna get done. Okay, we're gonna try when we have it done. Can I try something here? Because this is a. Uh, we have in my family. We have a lot of April birthdays, and also in my wife's side of the family, none of them can sing. Not like I can sing, but in my wife's family is dead. Yeah, so over the years. There's in, in her family. We get together for a, for a holiday or something like that. There's like 40 of us. There's people I go every year. I come like, who the hell are you? I don't know who you are. But we sing happy birthday. Whoever's got a happy birthday, we sing happy birthday. But since we know, and this has been going on for for the last 30 years or so, since we know that some people can't sing, and so when they don't sing, they don't sing happy birthday. They just kind of go. So we we put we put this out. It doesn't matter how you sing. You sing it as piss poor, absolutely the worst possible version of Happy Birthday. If you can all sing that together, it's a riot. It really is. So, there's no timing. There's no harmony allowed. You just sing whatever the hell you want to sing as loud and as obnoxious as you possibly can. So we want to do that for Brad tonight to bring you into to the Davis Anderson full. We're going to sing Happy Birthday just the worst we possibly can. Sort of like an olive garden? So, well, yeah, it's so like an olive garden. <laughs> What's the matter for you? Oh, happy birthday to you. That's what it is. So we're going to do this for Brad. So we're going to sing it. And I'll start it, So and I'll show you how it goes. Happy